All right, it's our last match in this league. Uh, I just recently lost to Burn, beat Amulet Titan, and then lost to uh, seemingly two unknown opponents. Even though I, I don't, I don't know why it says this. I, I, I legitimately don't know, but it, it says this. So uh, we're gonna pretend like everything is wonderful and and, and great, but uh, something something's up. I don't know, but whatever. Uh, but we're on to more four color rhinos content, and I'm, I'm very much disliking how clunky the deck feels a lot of the time. All right, for the fourth time in this league, I get to be on the play. I would love to take the play. Um, this is a pretty good opener. With double fetch. I think this is fine. We're going to keep it. And I am just going to fetch for Xander's Lounge, turn one. Mm-hmm. Uh, looking like a scam. Ragavan, sure. All right. So now we're just going to Bone Crusher this. We don't have anything to pitch with this. Uh, we're just going to get the Temple Garden, just because like, that's it's the easiest thing to get. Uh, yes, yeah, so I'd love to pay two life. Oh, uh, I did not cast... I, I want to cast Stomp, thank you. Alright, cool, and we will pass. So if I get scammed here, which is likely, um, I have nothing for them to take... Like, they could easily take the scammed being, of course, like, grief scam... They can easily just take the Violent Outburst. You know. So, you know, they just get, you know, double Ragavan start. Why not? All right, just have your thing. Uh, you got a Violent Outburst, which is fine. What are you doing? You're playing a DRC. What is this? Is this... Black Red Death Shadow. That's what it looks like. Now I guess I could I could have subtletyed with a uh, ardent plea. I guess I forgot about that. Um. Okay. Do your thing. Another crashing footfalls. How how fun. All right, they have to attack with this. I can't really do anything about this. Wait, what? When equal to 20 minus the highest life total. Fucking what am I, ex what am I witnessing here? What? What is this? This is Death Shadow, like, clearly. <sighs> Do I even beat this card ever? I mean, not really. I'll just do this in response, I guess. I whatever. Um, oh wow, uh, super cool. All right, so there's that. Um, part of me wants to subtlety in response to this, 
Because I will have them at six. Yeah, I think that's right. I think that's fine. I don't know for sure, though. All right, Leyline Binding will just about do it, honestly. Uh, okay. And we're going to pass. Leyline Binding takes care of that thing. It takes care of a Ragavan. Okay, sure. That's the only thing you're doing, so that's fine. And here comes the Layla I'm binding, so now I just take your Scourge of the Skyclaves. Yep. All right, so Black Red Death Shadow. Uh, I don't think I have anything for this. Um, I legitimately don't even know what they play. Hmm. All right, so in the sideboard, they have Chalice of the Void. So Besages are coming in. Uh, and that means Gemstones are coming out. They have explosives, prismatic endings. Boy, they just, they just have it all for this. Uh, Turok, I could see them bringing in Turok. I think what I want are these. I want these. I want I definitely want these. I feel like these aren't as necessary. Give me two Merc Tides. And then I don't know, take out an Arden plea, I guess. We'll run with that. That's my guess. Oh, why did I take out I'm an idiot. I shouldn't have taken out the gemstones. I should have kept in the gemstones. Uh this is a, a, a truly, truly dreadful hand. Tend better. Right, so we'll keep this. We'll put back the crashing footfalls. Um, so we're gonna go Xander's Lounge into planes and then have a fire ice for something. So I'm looking, they don't have any scam effects. That was the big thing with game one, was like I was worried that they were gonna scam a Ragavan. Bot sees. Alright, so there goes. A f yep, there goes Shardless Agent. So I'm just going to play Control until I get another... Con uh, what the hell is it called? Words. Uh, until I get another Cascade spell. Hmm... I'm just yielding till end step because I can't do anything here. Sure, there's a DRC. There's a bobble. So I just fire the I just kill this DRC, right? Oh, of course I got the creature. Oh, of course you got the fucking creature, man. Uh, 
another thought. You're going to thought seize again. Okay. Cracker. What is your opening hand? What is your opening hand where you have thought seize, thought seize, thought seize, two lands, double bobble, DRC? What is your fucking opening hand? That's crazy. All right, so fire here is pretty worthless. Like, there's just no reason for me to even attempt to cast it. Like, I don't care. You're only drawing one card from this? Oh, hi. <laughs> well, that sucks for you. All right, so we are just leyline binding this piece of garbage. And now we pass. What an opening hand. What? What an absolutely unreal opening hand. Double Thought Seas into Double Bobble with a DRC. Crazy. And there's a third Bobble. Let's go. There's a Chalice of the Void on zero, which is fine. I have a Besage you. I don't care. And a Blood Moon. All right, I sort of care now. Man, just just has it all. Just you just have everything, buddy. Good for you. All right, Temple Garden, Breeding Pool. Yeah, do your thing. I don't care. Uh, no, one, no one cares. No one cares. No one cares. All right, here's my untapped mountain and pass. You also play Mountain, and you pass. Okay. I'll eventually be able to hard cast a Leyline Binding, because what I have, I'll have two basic land types. Or I don't want to yield through the turn. I'll have two basic land types. So it'll be four mana. So I can actually just cast it now if I if I drew it. Which would be crazy. And they can't do anything because they only have Mountain Doom. Okay, so there's a Leyline Binding. So I'm going to play this first. Uh, on their end step, right? So it's one, two. So minus two, so three, four. So on their... I don't really feel like playing it until I get a Cascade spell, honestly. Cool. All right, so they're just chi they're just chilling. Yeah. I get a flooded strand. Nothing's unlocked for me yet, and I don't really care about any of this stuff right now. Like, neither of these really affect me in any way, shape, or form. Uh, Scourge. All right, it's a 1-1. One, one. I don't know why you're playing that when I have... I've uh, You've seen the, the Fire Ice, right? Now, of course, they could be playing Scam Effects. What are you bolting? You're bolting me. Okay. Okay. 
Oh, okay. That's fine. Um, sure. All right, Lorian revealed. Um, so I think what I'm just doing here is I'm going to binding the Scourge, which kind of sucks. Part of me wants to cycle this, though, for just a basic island. I think I'm okay taking four. Uh-huh. Claire blockers. Yeah, I'll take four. It's fine. It's an 8-8 eight, eight now. Play a polluted delta. And you pass. Alright, so now I'm gonna island cycle for this Lorien revealed. Get that. So now that I have that, I can actually just tap this in their upkeep and draw a card. Arden, please. So I do have a Cascade spell. So now it is time to... Uh, I have three, so this is down to... Yeah, I can do this. Okay. So now I'm going to Leyline Binding the Blood Moon. Beseju the, the Chalice. Two, three, yeah. We'll just do this three, these three, because then I can just fetch something here. Hmm. Yeah, I want to float. I want to float this red mana, actually. All right, so we're still in your end step. I'm not ready to pass through. Now we're gonna kill this chalice. Cause I wasn't sure what what lands I have left in my graveyard. Or I'm sorry, in my library. Alright, so we have a misty. Well, now we go ardent plea. I'm going to keep up these just in case they have an extra, uh, what's it called? In case they have an extra, uh, words. An extra blood move. That's what I'm trying to say. What you doing? You drawing a card? Sure. Interesting. Interesting that you're fetching and not doing damage to yourself. I guess because you want to just live. All right, so we just pass here. We just pass the turn, and your thoughts easing me. Okay, cool. All right, so you're at. So you you. So you realize I'm just, like, unless you have a kill spell, I'm just willing to take, I'm willing to just eat this eight. All right. So actually, so this does one to me, so this can do one to me. Takes me down to 11, which takes me down to two. 
they could bolt me. Unfortunately, what I have to do is I do have to block with a with a rhino. Do I have any other other lands in my deck? I just have wooded foothills and besages, so. Sure. You can play your Blood Moon. So, I don't have access to Shardless. You just, okay, so you just had everything just sitting in your hand waiting for something to happen. Got it. Bone Crusher. So is dealing five to them... Okay, so they just have to... I'm an 11. Ooh, okay, but they can... Oh, Mountain Dune shut off. Okay, so actually I can just stomp. Oops. And then play the Bone Crusher. Um, maybe fetching there was probably... Uh, fetching there was likely bad. Because I took an additional damage, I didn't have to take that additional damage. I could have just had the mana. Especially considering the fact that I didn't, ha I, I couldn't fetch for any of my basics. So... Alright, so they have to top deck a damage spell. Because I'm not blocking here. No matter what, I am not blocking here. Because I have the Exalted. Because I can attack, so I can attack with the Bone Crusher Giant and deal them X. So I'm just letting, you know, if they have Bolt or, t or something, good for them. Sure. Explosives on zero. What? Uh, okay, are you just showing me that you have this? Because you, you're just dead here. Right? That's what Exalted does, right? Yes. Go to combat. Attack with my exalted bone crusher giant. Hooray. Uh, I beat black red death shadow. Hooray, I did it. Um, I don't know. Weird, weird game. Just all in all weird game. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate you watching. I really appreciate you uh, getting subscribed to the channel, liking the videos, commenting, all that good stuff. Uh, we have been pretty impressed with, I guess, our growth early, like like pretty recently, because like we've been doing this for what the last three four weeks now. So having like pretty good growth, like we have, has been awesome. And seeing you guys comment and like the videos and all that stuff has been awesome. So uh, keep it up. We really appreciate you. Uh, thank you. We'll be back next week with more MTGO League content. And until then, good night.